Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Marcy. If you are here for the first time, I thank you for coming, uh, opening up that thumbnail. If you are a returning subscriber, I thank you for coming back as well, showing your girl some love. Today was an amazing day, you all. I filmed a, or recorded a video on beach scents for you all, and guess what? I took you to the beach with me in sunny Southern California. So later on, you'll be able to get a chance to hear a bunch of noise, um, see a lot of people and a lot of beautiful, pretty, and rainbow umbrellas, and you know, just look at the ocean a little bit. Um, it was nice, I sat out in the sun for about two hours. I had to hurry up and go because I don't want my fragrances to get too warm and you know, ruin them. Um, you know, I got a little bit of a tan, you know, had the sun, you know, tint some of this melanin of mine. I got a little pale during the winter time. Um, you know, I just had an amazing time, walked around, had some ice cream. Um, it was great to see everybody back out. Y'all, I had a moment the other day, I'm gonna confess. As I was driving um, down Abikini in Venice, I just saw everybody out having so much fun. You know, everyone was wearing their mask and, you know, being safe. Um, and I was just, you know, being all that we had gone through um, the past, what, year and a half with COVID and everything, I actually got so emotional in the car and, you know, just being in the hospital and coding people and people dying all of a sudden and, you know, just all the stuff that we went through in the hospital and just to see the world pretty much recovering is amazing. And I hope we continue to recover in grace and, you know, continue to just support one another like we did during the pandemic. And, you know, just take control of your life and just be, do your, um, do what you want to do. Be you, go out and have fun, but be cautious. You know, remember to, you know, um, wash your hands, wear your mask, you know, number one, wash your hands, you know, and if you're sick, stay home. So, and that's just not even with COVID, you know, that's a quarantine, but just even with the flu or if you feel any symptoms, you know, don't be selfish, you know, stay at home and make sure you get well and get yourself better so that you don't continue to get anybody else sick. But anyway, enough of that. Um, I got emotional. I was crying while I was driving. I had to pull over and I was like, man, we are, the world is actually recovering after so much that we went through in um, this past year. But anyway, I'm not going to get teary eyed again, but you know, um, it was amazing to see everybody out and everybody out today, you know, just getting some sun and attempting to get back to the new normal. It's not our norm, you know, as it was um, a year and a half ago, but it's the new norm. So we just have to get used to that. Anyway, um, let's talk about fragrances today. <laughs> So, um, um, yeah, I'll be uploading that video later because I did um, a summer, um, I did beach summer scents um, at the beach today and I had an amazing time. You know, people were staring at me like, what is this girl doing on the beach with all these bottles of perfume? Yes, I actually took all that perfume to the beach and, um, you know, because I just, it, it, it just makes it even better when you actually have it in your hand, you know, and able to smell it and explain it more. So anyway, enough of that rant. Um, today I have something very special for you all, but first please like, comment, subscribe, turn on those notification bells so that you'll be the first one to listen to what I have to say or give me feedback when I upload a video. Follow me on Instagram at Marcemello. It's M-A-R-C-E-M-E-L-L-0-W. Get outside and get some sun, y'all, okay? Um, anyway, we're going to be talking about another um, perfume that I recently got, and I've been wearing it for a couple weeks, and about a week and a half, and it's from the House of Raja, or Roja, and it's uh, Roja Elixir, and I'm so happy to, I, I love, when I read the notes, I was like, oh, the notes are amazing, you know, um, this I already have 51, Essence de 51 Parfum. I was like, it has to be amazing, right? Because I love that one so much, so I kind of figured, you know, I had to get it. Anyway, and it had a raspberry in it too. So anyway, I received it. I've worn it several times. Um, I'll let you know about the performance and everything as we go along. So first off, let's get into the box. Y'all you all know this box. I've shown it in a, re a review before. Um, if you push it up, it's just a stunning gold box. It's housed in this little, I don't like calling it a coffin, but some people call it a coffin. But it's housed here, you know, a nice polyester satin uh, box. I love the box though. It's very sharp and um, clean. So this is the bottle. The bottle's stunning as usual. This is the bottle. Sorry, it's a little um, 
not so shiny anymore because I have my little greasy hands all over it. Uh, but this is the bottle. Isn't it gorgeous? The same Raja top, the signature, all that. So in this fragrance, I'll read you the main accords. So um, the main accords, it's powdery, fruity rose. It's sweet, uh, woody, floral, musky, vanilla, violet, and yellow floral. This is a very sensual uh, fragrance. Um, it's sophisticated. It's, uh, it's very fruity. And I really do see myself or anybody else wearing this at like a winery or like um, I love going to the Viv Clico Polos. I've gone the past three years and they've been amazing. You know, that's my favorite champagne is Viv Clico whenever I have it, which is not very often, maybe like on celebrations or whatever. Uh, but Demi Sac Viv Clico is my favorite in the silver uh, bottle. But yeah, just at a polo, you know, at a lounge, uh, a girl's uh, day trip out. Um, you know, a derby, you know, somewhere where you can wear like those big hats and those beautiful floral dresses. You know, this is an elevated fragrance. It's very sensual, sophisticated. It's glamorous. Um, so I definitely wouldn't be wearing this around town, you know, running errands, things like that. Uh, I have plenty of other fragrances for that, but this is this is a sophisticated right here. So the bottle is sophisticated as well. The juice is, and uh, let's get into the notes. So in the notes, it's there are tons of notes, y'all. So uh, bear with me, okay? I think they're about. 20. So um, there's bergamot, there's rose de mai, there's raspberry, peach, violet, heliotrope, uh, there's ylang ylang, geranium, lily of the valley, jasmine, musk, there's cashmere and woods, there's vanilla, there's orris, which gives it that a little bit of that powdery note. There's violet leaf and bread, there's sandalwood, cedar, and cinnamon. Boom. I, I think out of all of my fragrances, this might be the ones that have the most notes listed. You know, no telling what else is inside. But anyway, aren't aren't those a ton of notes, you all? Yeah, there are. So anyway, um, now when I did wear this, uh, I love, love, love the projection. You know, it was amazing within like the first hour. Now the longevity, it needs some work. The longevity on my skin, it only lasts about maybe three to four hours I got. And you know, actually, I have it on today too, as well. Um, it was my signet. It was my um, scent of the day. On my skin, it lasts about four hours. Um, on clothes, it may last about six hours if you spray a little heavy. This is a very light to moderate scent, um, depending on how much you spray. Now, I wish because it is Raja Dove that all of the other ones like Essence Day 51 Parfum, that one is pretty much beast mode. You know, it's really, it's better than moderate. I'm not gonna call it beast mode, but it's better than moderate. Um, but it's not in your face uh, annoying. But it's an amazing fragrance and the performance is great. This, the performance is pretty moderate. Um, so for the price that you pay, I'm just slightly disappointed in the performance of, um, of Elixir. So maybe it's just my skin. I don't know if you do have this fragrance. Let me know down in the comments how you feel about the performance of uh, Raja's Elixir as well. So, um, th but I do love the juice. You know, I do love the fragrance. I love the bottle. I love everything else. The projection, you know, all of that about Elixir because it's stunning. Um, this is not a safe blind buy. It's definitely a spring summer scent. You do need to get, I blind bought it, but you know, um, that's just how my life is set up. So, and I think on Lucky Scent, if you order from Lucky Scent, they are out of samples at the moment. So, um, I don't know where you'll be able to get another sample, but I believe like you need to sample it unless you really like a lot of florals because this is Lily of the Valley, Ylang Ylang, this is Jasmine. Um, this, you could really smell the geranium inside. Um, there's geranium in a lot of Raja's, um, new their his new line and i really smell it you know um so it's a very distinctive smell so there's a lot of jasmine inside like i say ylang ylang lily of the valley rose all that so if you like floral then you might like this one if you don't like floral uh bright florals you know yellow this is considered like a yellow floral fragrance then you might not like this or you might want to get a sample first you know don't blind buy it so anyway that's elixir you know i'll go ahead and spray it for you all because i already have it on 
anyway, you know, it's pretty much, it has pretty much disappeared because it's been about um, five hours, you know, on my skin. It's, um, it's a disappearing act, y'all. Unless somebody else can smell me. Now, I was out earlier and it was about um, two hours, but someone said, oh, you smell good. But that was within that two hour mark. But now I really don't smell nothing. I don't smell anything. I don't smell nothing. Where, where did you learn English? Um, so anyway, I don't smell anything, but I'm gonna go ahead and spray it for you all. I love the automizer. It's like a, giving you a whole shower. You know, it's good. It's good, it's soft, it's a slight uh, raspberry, very, very mild fruitiness, you know, like raspberry peach. Now with this, y'all, yeah, you can really taste it in your mouth. And that's what I figured out the last couple times I sprayed it. So um, I suggest holding your breath, you know, while you're spraying this because it's so projecting in the opening that you really, you kind of taste it, you know? So, and the taste, it tastes just like the smell, <laughs> flowers. So anyway, this is good. Like I said, Lily of the Valley, you smell the rose de mai, you smell the geranium. Yeah, I really smell it, yeah. Jasmine, all that. So if you're a fan of those notes, then, you know, go ahead, uh, get your nose on this. Uh, but it's really good. You know, I like it. It's not amazing, like I say most, most are. This one is amazing right here. This one is great. This is amazing, this is great. <laughs> so anyway, um, this is great. Now I'm gonna t uh, just, Remind you all of 51, I do have a video on um, Essence de Parfum 51, and um, in this one, oh, it's good. It's a, like a raspberry, it's, you know, those, I made um, references to like those lifesavers or those cream lifesavers. It was that, excuse me, the creamy raspberry candy, hard candy that you put in your mouth. That's what this smells like, because it has like a little bit of powderiness to it. Uh, creamy, uh, like a, yeah, like, almost like a creamy, ice cream, swirl, vanilla, raspberry sorbet. That's what this is like right here. Um, and this, you have raspberry. It's a, a balance of tartness and sweetness at the same time. There's vanilla, there's cloves, there's cinnamon, um, there's rose, jasmine, sandalwood, and orris. This one right here is amazing. So if you have to get a Raja and you really wanna try this new line, then I would, I would um, recommend that you get uh, Essence 51. Yeah, this is good. Whew, I love this one. And you all know, already know that I do love this one. Yes, a lot of raspberry. I get the cinnamon, you know, the orris, you know. This is good. The vanilla. This is really good. This is my favorite so far. So anyway, I thank you all for watching my video on um, Elixir. You know, please go through the other ones. Um, like, comment, subscribe, you know, or like and comment on those as well. Watch those other videos. Let me know what you think if you have some of those fragrances. Um, I bid you all an amazing day. What is that? I bid you all adieu. Um, an amazing day. And, you know, go out, exercise, get some sun, drink some water, and live your life and take precaution. Love you all and uh, peace and love. Go out and spread amazing sillage. Bye-bye.